Well, a big water slide. That's our way out. Oh no. And uh, see, it's yes, amazing. Man. Everyone, stay together. Jesse, there you are. Jesse, the situation is getting out of hand. We simply can't stop all the monsters and make bolts. We stay here. The more danger my people will be in. This place is done for. The waterfalls. The waterfalls can take us to safety. What? Are you crazy? The waterfalls will just take us into the. There's water. land down there. We'll die if we fall down there. But there's nothing but monsters up here. There's land below the us. The void won't kill you. There's land down there. Everyone, just watch me and follow my lead, okay? Apparently we are going to just jump in. Jesse has done nothing but help us so far. I will show you just how much I believe in Jesse's word. Good for you, Milo. Look out! Oh no. <sighs> that must be quite scary for uh, those who hasn't fall down that before. You feel Everything's just so different and scary. Go Exciting. find some food. Well, let me tell you, Reggie. The first thing you need to do is go get yourself some wood. How, uh, how do I do that? <laughs> you find a tree and then you just start punching. Sounds like that. Oh, freeze, criminals! You're not going anywhere. I knew you'd stop it. Nice work. Now, this is just speculation, but I'm guessing they have some regrets. Yeah. I knew they wouldn't get away. They're in deep trouble. Ooh, I bet the blaze rods are in for a bad time. These Sky City people are not happy with them. Yeah. Hopefully they dig a deep hole, bury them in it, surround it with lava, and... Sorry. Got a little carried away there. <laughs> yeah, no kidding. Aiden. Oh, uh, hi, Jesse. I'm, uh, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry to cause all that trouble. I can see where it all went wrong. I've, uh, got some regrets. I hope you learned least. something. I hope you learned a lesson, Aiden. This didn't have to happen like this. I'd say you have a lot to think about. Yeah, yeah, that's for sure. Yeah. You were so angry and bitter, Aiden. You were so sure that I was always trying to take things from you, but you were wrong. I won't try to compete with you anymore. Attention! I'm not sure if I like that. Attention! Hello, hello, everyone, please. This is your founder speaking. Now that we're all safe, we need to organize. Start planning our new community. Are you listening to yourself? That's insane! We were prisoners long enough on that island in the sky! It is time for us to run free! Build whatever we please! Wow! Those two just cannot get along! Jesse, no I kidding. cannot allow my people to be influenced by this naive idealist! Well, I think it won't solve I'm anything. I'm sure I do look like a naive idealist! 
through the eyes of an oppressive dictator. Hey, both of you, fighting isn't gonna solve anything. It will if I win. Oh, of course you'd think that way. No, you don't understand. It will be night soon, and that is when the monsters come out. If we don't prepare, we'll be in danger. You're just making excuses to control our behavior, just like before. We must trust in ourselves, be able to learn from our mistakes. The people hmm. need to build! W what do we do? Who are we supposed to listen it's to? It's possible of course to the do people both. can build, but we need a system, some rules. Rules aren't bad. Well, I think you're both right. You don't want to just run around with no plan, but you can't schedule and organize everything either. People need to be free to try new things, but you've got to be safe about it. I suppose I still have much to learn. Thank you, Jesse. Yeah, compromise is uh, best. But I trust you. Well, Jesse, I suppose the era of Sky City is over. We may disagree about how to run this place, but I thank you for everything you have done. I guarantee that we will be telling stories about your visit for many, many years to come. Don't waste this the day chance. that Sky City was liberated. This is a second chance at making a civilization. Don't waste it, okay? I don't intend to. I give my solemn oath. You know something? She was a little scary at first, but she's all right. <laughs> I'm gonna miss that crazy guy. <laughs> I guess we should prepare for nightfall too. Mm. Without another portal, we're stuck here. Actually, we found portal. Start from square one. Ugh. Don't Just worry about the these punching trees were behind me. Now you shouldn't worry so much. I've got our way home all figured out. When I was on the ground with the founder before I totally found the portal, and you didn't say anything. <laughs> yeah, I'm actually gonna have to agree with Ivor on this one. Did I not mention it either? Because I could have sworn I said something. No, you, you no, didn't actually. You didn't. I guess the moment just never presented itself. Come on. <laughs> oh, hi. Ah, oh, there you are. I'm so sorry about her. That's okay. Looks like she's having fun running around. <laughs> yes, I think she took it pretty well when I told her she didn't need to be the Eversource anymore. What are we going to do with you now, huh? What are you going to do now? Besides, continue to be adorable, of are course. Are you going to set <laughs> her free? Given. Are you going to set her free? I tried to, actually, but she kept coming back. We've spent so long together. I suppose we sort of need each other now. After so long being the founder and the Eversource, now we can just be Isa and her best friend. Benedict. Ah, oh, that's a boy's name. <laughs> <laughs> what a closed-minded attitude. Oh, Jesse, wow. I would be honored if you would take this as a small token of our gratitude. Thank you. Come along, Benedict. We have a lot of adventures ahead of us. Well, there goes the Eversaws. Off to cluck and peck at seeds for the rest of its valuable life. Hey, Jesse. Pix will always uh, remind her uh, of Ruben. I'm uh, no, just, just missing someone. I saw those pigs. You know. Oh. Yes. He would be really happy to know you're still having adventures like this. Yeah. Just not without him. See? Just like I told you. One portal back home. I just can't wait to put this whole world behind us. Oh, is someone being grumpy? <laughs> no, I'll leave though. I was just hoping for a real treasure, is all. <laughs> Livestock's no proper treasure. Although I wonder what would happen if you put that tiny crown on a different chicken. Come on, guys, let's go home. Yeah. Let's get Bit back. Axel and Olivia here will be fed. They'll never believe me. it. Um, that's not what I was expecting. Me neither. Oh, wow! That's a lot of portals. Let's see. For some reason, I can't uh, actually check out uh, these choices, so 
Sorry about that. But let's just uh, continue. I kind of want to see them myself, uh, but... Sorry, I can't really help with that. It was uh, always fun uh, to analyze them uh, after every episode, but uh, this time uh, I have to kind of uh, skip that. I'll see if I can uh, get those working before I actually upload this episode, and if I can, uh, I'll uh, I'll be sure to add it uh, after these uh, end credits. But that episode. Overall, it was fun. I I kind of liked it, uh, even though I kind of wish we had uh, would have Olivia with us. I enjoyed her on uh, those first uh, four episodes. And biggest complaint I had was uh, about those subtitles and voice acting. Not because voice acting was bad, but because uh, those subtitles and voice acting didn't match at all. That's the uh, biggest issue I had with uh, this whole game. Well, not whole game, but this uh, whole episode. But it was uh, nice to see those uh, Skyblock uh, kind of uh, represented uh, in these two. It's one of uh, one of the ways uh, people like to play Minecraft nowadays. Uh, they make uh, modded uh, some mods uh, make it that uh, you only start with uh, maybe one or two dirt blocks and uh, a tree stump and you have to grow out from there. There are some uh, ways uh, they achieve that. One is uh, that uh, they give you few dirt blocks to and water and lava source. Or they actually have some uh, kind of uh, ways uh, for you to craft uh, leaves uh, or trees you get uh, into more useful materials. It's a... Uh, it's a... Uh, kind of fun experience, actually. I... I'll uh, admit I on, haven't gotten far on that kind of game myself, uh, but uh, I've seen uh, some uh, fun uh, let's plays of that, uh, and I recommend you to check it out too, if you have a chance. And that uh, ending. That uh, set up uh, quite nicely for that uh, Continuing continuation uh, for those uh, newly revealed uh, episodes that are incoming, and it's a uh, surprisingly surprisingly accurate uh, thing that or problem that was uh, faced here that uh, you can uh, you need some rules. But you can't have too many of them, because uh, too much, uh, too many rules just uh, just feels oppressive. But if you don't have any rules, there's a uh, there's a uh, kind of like situation with Ivor in uh, our. I guess it's a hometown. That's. Or Temple of Order of the Stone rebuilt. Well, anyway, back uh, at home, we had uh, Ivor pouring lava on uh, everyone else. The simple solution for that uh, Ivor situation would have been just uh, build some kind of a pool where or edges of pool where that lava could have uh, flown into and uh, stay there. That way it wouldn't have... Uh, anyone wouldn't have uh, accidentally jumped into that lava and uh, Ivor would have uh, gotten to keep his uh, house. Hey, 
I'm uh, just going to jump right in from here in the middle of my video and tell you I finally solved my issue with uh, my choices uh, not showing up and uh, here they are so let's uh, go quickly over them let's oops these were first ones uh, I was going for these so did I demolish Ivor's lava house Yes, because it was safety hazard, uh, and it has been a few weeks, a uh, week or two, I think, uh, since I played uh, this, and uh, I actually watched this episode uh, by some other players, and apparently, if you chose not to demolish it, they would have uh, done exactly what I originally wanted to do. Oh well, I was a small minority on this. And about 50-50 ran, ran from uh, cards and, uh, and stayed behind. We ran from them. And I'm... Uh, I'm uh, not uh, really surprised uh, that uh, so many chose to help uh, Founder or Isa rather than help Lucas which I think uh, if you chose to help Founder it was uh, much better uh, story wise it made a more interesting reaction from people I think As, at least uh, you saw what I did uh, when I saw Lucas fall down I really w was shocked at first and then I'm actually quite surprised about this uh, that 50-50% of people chose to help Aiden to safety and 50-50 uh, chose to left, uh, left him I thought uh, that most of uh, people might have uh, gone and left him and uh, not so evenly torn but that also means it's a good choice to make because it's a, it's a shows that well at least I think it shows that it's a divisive topic. And who did you leave in charge of reconstruction? You and 67% of players made Isa and Milo share power. Hmm. Well, not really big surprise there. It's uh, better to work together and uh, to compromise than uh, give uh, power for one people, one uh, guy or girl. Well, that uh, was all of them. So, I'll uh, give. Uh, I'll give this uh, back to my old self now. Bye! Anyway, overall I like this episode uh, quite a lot. And I'm actually looking forward to those upcoming episodes, even if uh, they will be going to be released. Uh, I think they are going to be released as some sort of uh, DLC. I've been trying to avoid them as much uh, spoilers as uh, possible about uh, them uh, too, so I have no idea about them actually yet, what they will be about. Other than uh, they're more adventures of our Order of the Stone. But I'm kind of a... Uh... Well, there was one thing I'm not uh, so sure about. It was uh, including, including uh, Ivor, because I don't think we are actually in... Uh, at least uh, that kind of feeling uh, was left to me. That we weren't uh, really friendly with him uh, at the end of uh, episode 4. And uh, I'm not sure if I like the, his role in uh, our order nowadays. In any case... I thank you for watching and I will see you on next game.
goodbye.